Here are the Sons of Libertas. We are still uh, in Berlin at the European Students for Liberty Conference. We are here now with Katie Reisenwitz. Uh, she is a um, very, very, very popular uh, blogger in the States, I would say, in my point of view, in the libertarian movement. Uh, please introduce yourself to the crowd, especially in Europe and in Germany. Absolutely. So, like you said, Kathy Reisenwitz, I work for Young Voices, which is a new project of Students for Liberty, where we're trying to get young libertarians published in the mainstream media. So, we've had some of our advocates published in places like the New York Times, we have uh, two columns in the Huffington Post, um, and various other right-wing media as well. Um, and we've been on uh, Fox News and Al Jazeera America, uh, just... Uh, you know, getting the message out there about liberty. Um, and then in, as well, I'm a blogger at uh, kathyreisenwitz.com. Um, my blog is called Sex in the State, and I try to tackle issues that I feel like libertarians have not traditionally spent enough time talking about. One of the topics is uh, feminism, what it, what it means for you, because in, especially in Germany it has a, like a bad taste, I would say. Absolutely. I think there are kind of two reasons for that. Um, first of all, I think people associate feminism with a kind of statism and socialism, which I think is really uh, unfortunate. People also think of um, individualism um, and individual liberty as somehow opposed to feminism, whereas what I'm trying to bring forward is the idea that uh, feminism is a lens through which to view the world and a way to find ways that we can make individual liberty available to women in ways that it hasn't been before. And so I think that this is really essential because the ideas of liberty have not traditionally appealed to women very well. And so I want to change that by trying a new tactic. Yeah, that sounds nice. Um, how do you see the development of the libertarian movement, if you can call it like a movement? I mean, I think we're getting a lot better at trying to be more appealing broadly. I think that it's almost like we've gotten a, a little bit better. I mean, look at this conference, 600 people. Uh, in ISFLC in America was, you know, over a thousand kids getting together and getting excited about the ideas of liberty, um, trying to put a new face on it, not being, you know, hardline, um, you know, only caring about ideas. I think we're trying to get a softer image where we care about ideas because what they do for people. Where, where do you see the libertarian movement and the uh, European, or oh no, the Students for Liberty in maybe five years? I mean, I think it's just going to grow and grow, and I think it's going to get even more importantly more diverse, and so it's going to appeal to a wider uh, section of the population, which I think, if we are going to grow, is going to be essential. So these, uh, some of these panels that we've had, you know, how to reach out to people that have traditionally ignored us, the feminism panel, I think they're all essential in making sure that this growth that we need to see actually happens. Um, how is your, is it your first trip to Germany, by the way, and... This is my first trip to Europe, like, period. It's been so much fun. It's kind of overwhelming, but Berlin is really, like, clean and nice and easy to get around, and so everybody's been super helpful. Uh, it's been amazing meeting all these awesome European, uh, you know, students and, and professionals who are interested in the ideas of liberty. It's been so much fun. Yeah, we had, we had the same, uh, like you, the same experience. Uh, having, thanks for having you. Uh, at the end, you can say something to the crowd, maybe mention your website, everything you always do. Absolutely. So I would encourage people to follow the Young Voices website because it's a great way to, um, you know, read young people who are interested in the ideas of liberty. If you're under 35 and you're interested in getting published, uh, go ahead and apply. It's uh, youngvoicesadvocates.com slash apply. Um, and then if you want to read my work and figure out what I'm doing, I'm at kathyreisenwitz.com slash blog. Um, I'm also on Twitter at, at Kathy Reisenwitz. And on Facebook, friend me, I am facebook.com slash Kathy Reisenwitz. It's C-A-T-H-Y-R-E-I-S-E-N-W-I-T-Z. Thanks a lot. Thanks.